We've all seen the incredible benefits that STEM Enhance and STEM Flow bring to your body's natural renewal system. Now, STEM Tech introduces a new approach to helping active individuals get the edge. Whether you are an elite athlete or a weekend warrior, STEM Tech has created a regimen to help you be at the top of your game. Let's join internationally acclaimed sports nutrition expert, advisor to Olympic athletes, and STEM Tech's own Vice President of Global Product Training and Sports Marketing, Heather Livingston, as she introduces you to STEM Sport, the ultimate fuel for renewal. Welcome to STEM Sport. You know, the first question people always ask, and it's every time we talk about it, is what is STEM Sport? Is it a product? Is it, what is it? So it's the concept of using STEM Enhance and STEM Flow for the active body. Of course, every container we live in, this body, we call a container. I affectionately call it a container. It's, we live inside of it and we have to nurture it and embellish it with good nutrition and activity every day. So when we're talking about STEM sport, a lot of people think that, oh, I'm not an athlete, it doesn't apply to me. But every human body demands activity to function in a state of well-being, not only providing good nutrition, but also activity every day. Activity to maintain muscle mass, to maintain bone density, so that in, if you have good strong bones, you can carry your skeleton around, the whole bit. So every active body person has three primary uh, ideas. And you might not think about them, they might not have been conceptualized, but we're talking about being active and, and maintaining a state of activity. We want good focus. We want to be able to perform whatever that means to us at whatever level. And we want to, maybe we don't think about it, but we need to be able to recover. We need to empower our body to have the ability to recover fully so that then we can continue to be active and feel good about it. And especially when people are starting to exercise, they, they go out and they maybe work out a little too hard because they're really motivated and then they get sore and stiff and their motivation goes down. So if we can assist in reducing recovery time, and that's a key to this area, reducing recovery time, then we can empower our body to feel great and be more energetic. So the basic fundamentals about activity and reducing recovery time and all that stuff is everything we do in life actually affects our muscle cells. In the scientific terms, the muscle cells are called muscle fibers, and muscle fibers get damaged in everything we do. The damage is called muscle fiber degradation or microscopic tears, but what that means is we simply feel uh, sore and stiff. So everything we do in life affects our muscle cells, and that's a normal process. So it's up to us to give our body good nutrition, and of course we're talking about stem cell nutrition here, um, to assist in reducing recovery time. And so what happens? We, we reduce our muscle fiber, and again that muscle fiber is just a nice way of saying muscle cell. The muscle cell gets damaged. What does that mean to you and me? We might not realize, oh, I damaged my muscle fibers today, but what it means to us is we might feel a little stiffness, a little swelling, a little soreness. And when we get a level of soreness, the body kicks in a protective mechanism to inhibit contraction. So the more aggressive we are in exercising without enough stretching and warm-up and proper techniques for many of us, if we aren't used to lifting weights, we get a level of soreness. At a certain level, that soreness will inhibit contraction. Now for you and me, maybe that's not important. Yeah, we feel discomfort, we go around and we, we go, oh, oh, I worked out yesterday, I'm not feeling so good today. But as, we get, as people get more serious in sports and they're training and competing, either an amateur athlete or an elite athlete, this is where the area of recovery time becomes really important. Because with less ability to contract your muscle, there's a less ability to perform fully in your sport, whatever your sport of choice is. For the elite athlete, either amateur or professional, this is where an area of concern comes into play. And so if we can assist them in reducing the recovery time, we can impact potentially their performance. So we do have a solution, of course, and that's why STEM sport. People go, well, well what, you know, STEM sport, why? Why STEM sport? The solution is to assist in reducing recovery time through a few key mechanisms. First is to help deliver nutrients and oxygen. So if we can help deliver nutrients, oxygens while you're exercising, of course, 
in all aspects of life, but while you're exercising and while you're training and while you're competing, we can again ha continue that supply of fuel and oxygen while we're training. We can also help reduce the repair and uh, recovery process by, as you know, d helping release more stem cells, and we can um, help with removal of byproducts. Now, byproducts we've all felt. We might not have realized what these byproducts were that we're building up when we're exercising. But one of the primary f uh, fuels of exercise or being active or simply everything in life activity is the primary fuel that we burn is muscle carbohydrate, known as muscle glycogen. So if an athlete comes up to you and say, well, I burn muscle glycogen, you go, oh yeah, that's just carbohydrates. I know what that means. So if you know what that means, it's just a comfort level. Muscle glycogen or muscle carbohydrate burns very quickly, very rapidly, it gives you great energy, but just like a soft burning wood, it leaves a lot of ash or a lot of rubbish or a lot of byproduct left over. And you know what that byproduct feels like. It burns. It's called lactic acid. I always say if you put acid on your skin, it's going to burn. That's easy to understand. If you have acid within the muscle belly and around the muscle cells and it sits there in pools,